What we think that Biosphere 2 can do is play two different roles in science. The first is that it provides a bridge between laboratory and real world experiments. And then the second thing that we think Biosphere 2 will contribute to is thinking about the earth science in an integrated way. So these two things are really unique. They reflect uh, the, the value of the apparatus and they also reflect the value of doing science in an interdisciplinary framework. There, there is the problem of global change, and global change has many facets. It's changes in temperature, it's changes in carbon dioxide concentration, it's changes in uh, species distributions on the landscape, and all of these things, um, they interact, and they interact in complex ways. But interestingly, they're all linked by water. So rising temperatures obviously uh, change the way that water evaporates from systems. Uh, rising carbon dioxide concentrations changes the way that plants use water. Species use water in different ways. And so if we focus on water balance as a way of asking questions, then we actually can build models that tell us something about global change. And uh, one of the very first studies asking this question of how do plants die you know, we did it here in the biosphere, and it spawned a whole area of investigation, and, and we're very happy with the impact. <laughs>